Yo guys, welcome back. It's me again, it's Bill I Gamer, and I'm here to carry on from where we started in our little town of Billsborough in Banished, a new game which just came out. Um, if you guys remember from the last video, we were just building a hunting cabin and a fishing dock here, and we were just starting to get the crop field up and running, hopefully. And I managed to find out that uh, I was doing it all wrong, and I actually needed to pick either cabbage it looks like or a pumpkin so I would rather cabbage and now there's two people working here so that's good so I'm gonna get some the farmers going which I can't remember who they were actually let me just check it, it was Let's see, there is two farmers I'll find them so it's not you aha oh it's Yoselin she's decided to change from a builder to a farmer and provide lots of food for the city how lovely but I think that that farm there, at 6x6, six six, maybe isn't big enough. And so, uh, I think that um, I'm going to put a nice bit of a farm around the back of these houses. So people can straight away go from work here, go around the side of the house, and go out and work in a lovely new farm, I guess. I mean, let me see. So I want to go on a crop field again. Or I could get an orchard. I mean,. Grow some fruit trees. I think I'll put that over there, maybe. So yeah, I'm gonna make another farm. Let's just make it here. Let's make it five long. So it's five by fourteen. A new crop field there, and then for fruit trees, should I grow it in the middle of the town? I think that'd be nice. There. Yeah, 7 by 13, so. Nah, actually. Maybe a bit further in. So, 5 by 10. Looks like a nice size there. Now, what I'm not sure about is whether you have to have a different person to be a harvester. I'm, well, I'm, I'm guessing that just counts as part of the farm. Well, let's just see. If I put up the amount of farmers, then let's play. Everyone's starting to go to work. Oh no! Robert Trand and Shaladin. They don't have any uh, firewood. We don't need. We don't want that. That's horrible. No one deserves to live in a place without any firewood. That's, why would anyone do that? So basically, what I need to do, I need to build like, a place which makes firewood. Now let me just see. That's food resource. Aha. Use woodcutter, you used to chop logs into firewood, oh god, which are then used to heat homes in the winter, that's what we need. Um, mm, I think I'd rather it out here by the hunting cabin. Would that disrupt it? I don't think so. Mm -hmm -hmm. Um, let me move forward one there. Yeah, we've got enough wood for it, we've got enough stones, so I'll put it there. Oh! Let's just make sure, because now we've got lots of things to build, so we'll change any labourers who haven't got work and put them into builders, so people can start building. Because obviously we've already got the hunting cabin going on the go, and we've got the fishing dock which hasn't started, and now I've just gone and placed a woodcutter. Probably not the smartest idea, to be honest. But... I just want to. I want this town to progress quickly. So let's look at the moment. So the farmers are at work. Here, here is a farmer. Here is Skyland, another farmer. Where's well Yosemin? And she'll be going and just planting seeds gratefully in our community. As you can see, at the moment we've got four farmers, and uh, well, as you can see, G and Carlis is helping us out by removing all these rocks here but at the moment we don't need four farmers it's a bit excessive I think and maybe um, just too much for a small town as we are at the moment but as you can see the hunting cabin's almost done so I might just take away a farmer and put it in like as a hunter that'd be a fine idea and as the builders are going around, I think I'll hold two back just to chop down some trees and stuff like that. So let me just check. It's on here, harvest trees. Now, 
I don't know if I should harvest these trees because these trees add a nice effect, but I don't know. I'll remove the trees which are in the way. So these trees are in the way of um, me being able to get there. She, these trees because I've now built the um. Oh, I always forget what it's called. The wood cutter. That's what I'm building. I'm building a wood cutter. So if I get all these trees, I can chop them down into firewood, and everyone will be ready. Enable or disable production. Well. He looks like he's working to me. But at the moment I've got one, I'll add another. People are chopping down trees, fair enough. Let me just check. Uh, stone? Um, well, let me see. 16 stone here. 8 stone here. It's not going to take up everything. And we've got stone cut here anyway, so... It's fine. It's going well. Got the hunting cabin up and running. We've got two hunters there. So at the moment, things are good. We've still got a labourer, so... Do I put it into a builder? Or do I put it into a farmer? Or a hunter? I think I'll put, it into, I put, I think I'll put, it into, uh, I think I'll put her into a hunter. Three people of two, so she's not doing anything, so I'll make her into a builder. Or he, I'm sorry, I don't... I'm not sure if it's he or she, or whatever. But they, these poor people have still got no weather whatsoever not weather no fire that's it and the woodcut is not complete it's no one's taking stuff over who's supposed to be laboring here oh I get it these guys are making the fishing dock first probably yeah they're making the fishing dock fair enough I mean I did place the fishing dock first so I can't say anything against that Let's see. We've got, we got mushrooms there, so if we were to make a herbalist, I think that's right, then you can harvest the mushrooms and make them into medicine. So, as you can see, my he average health has actually already gone down. Already. It's only. It's, what's it been? It's been less than a season. Now, it's going to be a race against time now, because I didn't really know what I was doing with the farms. It's going to be a race against time to get these up and running. I don't think the orchard's going to make it, it's going to make Pekin. I don't know what Pekin is, but I was thinking of Pekin duck. I don't know about you guys, but it's obviously some type of fruit tree. And then with this is 18% complete. People need to start moving. There's the laborers and aha, you guys. Oh, it's Yosselin. I always seem to find her. It's just. And then is it Skyland? Oh no, it's Shannon, then the newest adult in our town, and obviously Buston. And um, if you guys are wondering where the general statistics have gone, it's still there. I'm surprised they got rid of it. Uh, Robert Trand has become an adult, so he, I think he's the one living here, isn't he? Yeah. And Shannon Din is well. I just forgot to put this back up. Um, chosen, obviously, we don't want a map as I said before. Chosen limits placed on resources, so we can limit any food we got here, so. I think we'll just want maximum 500 of each of these. A child named Dominica was born. So we just had our first child born, I think. Unless I'm wrong. I think I might be wrong because we've now got 18 people. So I've missed the first childbirth. Well done to me. But who is it born to? That is the question. Well, I can't remember. Why did I get rid of that? Her name was... Oh no, there is two children. Is... Oh my god. Isomanifoni? It's quite... um. A long name, but we'll go with it. And Dominica, so so they weren't born in them houses or this one. Aha, Isomanatoni or whatever your name is. And there's Dominica. So the two next door neighbours both had kids. That pretty much they both had it in early summer. I'm not sure if it was the same day. But I don't know. I just don't know. No, that's good to see. The fishing dock is almost done. And after that, the builders. I can always put down the amount of builders I've got, and it should be fine. How much food has the hunters got? Let me check. How do I check? That is the question. There must be a button. Show or hide? Aha! Aha! 200 venison. So already that's decent. It's obviously, I don't think it's going to be enough to get us through the whole summer, but... 
We're not going to die of starvation at the moment. That's a good thing. And the fishing dock is almost done. It's just it's just got 31 of 45, 32, 33. It's going to be done in the next half a minute or so. You know, it's it's going well. It's, it's going very well. And then obviously we've still got the woodcutter. No one's bought anything over because they're so busy focusing on the fishing dock, which is going to hopefully bring in lots and lots of fish for us to use and make our town have lots more food. And as I said, with the farm here, we're going to want to grow pumpkins because pumpkins are a lot different to, uh, was it cabbage? Yeah, cabbage. Yeah. So no one's managed to farm any cabbage. That is disappointing. I'm guessing they planted the seed, it just hasn't grown. So, put the builders down and put the farmers up there. There we go. And, um, they're chopping down trees now. So I think that was, the, yeah, that was the next thing on my list, wasn't it? Chop down. Oh, Ezekiah! I don't think I missed you. You were born, I'm guessing, this house. Damn it, oh dear. No. So, is this house a 10 year old? Oh, this house. Yeah. So now all three of these houses down this side have all had children. They're all gone into childhood. Yeah. <laughs> but we still got the orchard to build after we've built the woodcutter. And it seems that they're still digging stone over here, so they're still gonna have to carry all that around. And it's gonna be quite long to watch, so I'm gonna speed it up a bit. So as you can see, it's just it's a normal game, you can speed up, I'm on times 5. Storage for logs, stone and iron is near capacity. Aha, the reserve of food is low. What are you doing, men? What are you doing? We still haven't found any more venison. That's a shame. But, what was it? Storage for logs. Oh wow, the stockpile is actually almost full. The storage barn isn't, but the stockpile is, so I might have to make another stockpile after they're done with this. So as you can see, I think, yeah, times 10 is the most you can go up to. But now, because my storage pile is full, 98% full, they're having to place logs outside. That's horrible. Unless they use it to build the woodcutter. Now, there's absolutely no... If you guys pick up this iron... Oh, look, a child named Sharp is born. But back to what I said. If these guys pick up this iron, take it over here, and then bring it back, that is so pointless. Oh god! Oh my, I forgot to assign a fisherman! Of course I'm not going to catch any fish if I don't have any fishermen. I mean, what was I thinking? There we go, we've got two fishermen working. Now I might be doing too much for my first year, but I've got to have projects and I'm going to try and get loads of food. Still need to build the woodcutter. God, is those people are going to freeze in the winter. And after I've done that, I should probably build another storage pile. So, there it is. And a stockpile, I meant, sorry. So, I can build it any size, anywhere I want. So, looking around, I might just build it as a, a move on from the last one. So, that one's 4x5? No, 4x4. Four storage for logs and stuff. There you go. Now, do you have to build that? No, you don't. So, straight away starts, people are moving everything. Good to see, good to see. We've got two fishermen fishing, getting us all 24 fish already, but we're still really low on food. I mean, obviously these people can work through the winter, but they're... Oh, 400. So, I think these are the hunters out here, aren't they? Yep, these are the hunters out here, gathering up some nice venison from the deers. It's going good, and the stockpile's being filled up from stone and iron, which we've dug from over here to make the new place, the woodcutter. But, overall, these people shouldn't freeze. It's 21 degrees, 20 degrees Celsius now, because it's early autumn, and, uh... They do really need to get a move on because early autumn, it's going to be autumn soon and then these people might freeze and then maybe die, you know, they're only 11, that would be horrible, you know, one just turned 12. Oh, a child named Domin. What the? But we leave these people for two seconds 
And they've got three kids, Domin, Rene and Shilomina. I swear they didn't have children before, but... Oh, and Shard was born here, so now I've got nine children to twelve adults. That is ridiculous. But, these people here are doing well. The, the crops still haven't grown, I don't understand. Work, damn you, work. Harvest. I shouldn't have probably pressed harvest because it was a 0% yield, but oh well. They're farmers, they can do that, I guess. <laughs> well, what the? What are you doing, Cheryl? You can't just leave for help to not. Ah, ah, there we go. Yeah, the woodcutter is done. Just in time, it's just gone autumn. We need, we need a woodcutter. So, there it is, wood cutter. So, we've got four farmers, two fishermen. We don't need builders. What are we building? Look around, there's nothing to build. So, we'll put that down. I'm guessing farming's going to have to wait till next year, unfortunately. And a wood cutter. There we go. That should do us fine. Go through. With that a child oh no a child named Clevet was born and it's probably to these guys yeah that's horrible we got a zero year old child here who can't even have any heating I I mean that's just not fair on the child obviously the parents have been living in these poor conditions for far too long themselves but everyone has to make sacrifices when moving and being banished from your last place it must be so such a traumatic experience for them as you can see, they've made, they've got logs going in here. Just people placing logs. Him chopping up all the firewood. And has the firewood made it here yet? Yep, four firewood. 97% full. And there she goes. Shalorendin. Gone to get some. Come on. Yeah. Gone. Now she's got some firewood, so. She's not gonna die. Hopefully, but the logs are being taken over here at a steady pace. I mean, I'd rather it went quicker. So, put that down. Put the labourer and food reserve is low. Fantastic! It's exactly what we want to see. But these people, you need to take some fish over, mate. Like, seriously. Um. No, we need to just have some labourers. Take some stuff over, man. Seriously. Look, he's just getting four logs. What's that about? And these fishermen, they've got food. Why isn't he being taken? Look, there's fish just sitting here. Come on, man. Pick it up and take it to the food storage. We don't want anyone dying in the winter. That'll be, the, that'll be a tragedy of the century. Let me, let me see this. 600 venison and people have already eaten it all. <laughs> wow. You guys are greedy. Why are no citizens of... Oh yeah, I haven't put it. Never mind. But for some, I think obviously I you should start in spring and, on the farms. So. I don't see why they wouldn't work, but... I'll find it out eventually, guys. Don't worry. The reserve of food is still low, but... We've still got venison, uh, but are people transporting? I hope they are. Ah, oh, that's better. Look at that. We've got lovely logs of firewood. The reserve of food is low. I get that, but we're cutting. We're getting as much fish as we can. Oh, come on, labourers, move, move! Ah, oh, you children shouldn't just stand there. Why are you just taking food up? Take it to the actual dock. Or is people going to start dying? Go! Go! There's only 26 left! You can make it, man! Good man. Oh, that was literally six. <laughs> How? Where's all my venison gone? Has everyone eaten venison? Seriously. They've got eight, 800 venison just gone? Ah, oh, who is it? I'm not going to blame anyone, but you're looking pretty suspicious. You're walking too quickly. No, you stand still. You're a labourer. Your name's Darol. Have you been eating everything? I hope not. 
if you have been, that is not a town spit. Oh my god, we're on six. We're all gonna die. Ah, oh, we're on 28. Well, I thought we were all gonna die, but Elmas has become an adult. She's the first person. Oh, I got that one wrong again. She's the third person, but still, every person helps. So, what should we make it? Um, looking at this, should I just keep her as a labourer? I mean, I want a farmer when it comes round spring, but it, I don't know. As soon as I see it go spring, um, I'll put some farmers in then. But at the moment, it's not really. Oh, how is a reserve of firewood low? Come on, man. Chop, damn it. Chop. Why is no one bringing any wood? There you go. This guy. God, you guys go through firewood like mad. There we go. 12 firewood. Aha! Oh, no, it's late winter. I thought it was spring for a second now. But, um. Oh, guys, it looks like. And miraculously, we went down to six food, but it looks like we've managed to get through the winter. And it should come spring any time now. Oh, and it's raining. Yes. Everyone loves a bit of rain, don't they? Oh, man. Mm, especially here in Britain. It's been raining the whole winter, and it's even raining in the game. It knows where I'm from. It knows. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, five farmers. Well, it's still late winter, but I'll put three up in farming. Four, because it's going to be spring soon, and we need people to start farming. That might make people idle for the moment. Hmm. I don't know, really know if that was a good idea. Oh, it's early spring? No, it is early spring. People are working there. And come on, man, plant the seeds. I don't know what you're doing. You're just literally poking the ground. What, <laughs> what help is that for... You just, you left like half of this. Where you, that's not even the lot. You're just literally poking around it. Okay, oh, this guy's finishing. Oh, 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 there we go. Gennaro, hello again. I haven't seen you in quite a while. But it's back to early spring and uh, the reserve of food is low. As we've been told many of times. But as you can see, we've got three stacks of fish. That, that says it all. It's just people are not coming over and collecting it. That's just outrageous. Put down a hunter and we'll put up the two labourers. I'm guessing that'll be good and everything. But for now, guys, I think I'm going to end this video here. Please like and subscribe. If you enjoy it, please leave me a comment about what I could do to make my town better. And, well, guys, I'll see you next time, alright?